Let's say you're given a chi-squared test statistic value, but you aren't given a p-value. Could you figure out the p-value? Well, you could use a table of values to approximate the p-value, or you could use your calculator. To do this, you'd hit second, vars, find chi-squared CDF, which stands for chi-squared cumulative distribution function, Then we can enter the test statistic value. Let's say it's 10.180. Then enter your degrees of freedom. Excuse me, then enter an upper limit. So let's say uh, up to 100 or 1,000. Remember, the distribution continues forever to the right. So entering a large number is all we need to do there. And then we enter our degrees of freedom. Notice this is the same as the p-value we got earlier in the previous example that we're looking at. Um, also, I want to point out that notice that the template didn't come up here. It's probably because I have my stat wizard turned off. So let me go back to get the stat wizard turned on. I hit mode and I come down here to the very bottom. And oh, interesting, my stat wizard is turned on. So this is one that I guess is not part of the stats wizard menu. It's not going to give me a, um, a template to fill in. So either use a table of values or remember the syntax for the chi-squared distribution function.